Yes. Oh, 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 oh. Hey, she won. Shake on that. You know what I'm talking about? Don't make sense. You know what I'm talking about? Y'all, I'm changing my purse. I just want to find some like house decor. Um, I have to make grocery today. Um, I have to go pick up her cake today as well. Um, and yeah, I'm trying to make today an eventful day. Um, because I was a little sad earlier. So yeah, I'm currently at Ross. They opened up at 8 30. Be back home by at least 11 30, 12 o'clock. The house is already clean. I just have to put the groceries and stuff up when I get back. It's a Lord Bay type of day. I got on my K to Maze. So hopefully today is a good day. I want to go to Target. I went to Ross last night and I found two pictures and I left them in the trunk just in case I find something else at this Ross. Um, and I spent $30. <clears throat> on each one of them and then i found like a whole bunch of clothes for my son my oldest son um he's skinny and petite how i used to be so they had a lot of stuff on clearance there so i picked that up and i'm gonna show that to y'all later probably probably not because he be watching my vlogs too so i don't want him to see it so i might not show that i might do that on tiktok but yeah, so we're about to go in Ross. Then we're going to Home Goods. They open in like an hour. And then I'm going to, or I might go to Ross, Target, then Home Goods and wait till Home Goods open. Because I want to be the first one when they open. Because if you know, you know. But yeah, y'all, come on. Let's go to the store. Okay, so y'all, Nala, I forgot my little stand order. Nala is in size nine women and seven kids. Like, she passed me up. So every time I go to Ross, I always look at their shoes because. Homegirl got a big ass feet, so we just trying to see. I found these boots, but I don't know if she'll be able to fit them or not. Like a eight, I thought these are cute. She likes stuff like this. But um, I'm just looking, like I hate filming in public now. I don't know, it's just social anxiety now. I don't know what it is. Oh, these are cute. I love me some, a good house slipper, baby. These are cute, very cute. Yeah. So that's when I'm walking. I check the shoes first before I go to any other department. And see um, what they have. But as y'all can see, like, it's quiet in here. So if you ever need to go shopping or whatever, go to Ross. Go to Ross like as soon as they open. Like I promise you, you will not be mad. You will not be fucking mad. Cause listen, you hear one person talking on the phone. Cause she get up. But hey, it is what it is. Right? I'm gonna show y'all some stuff that I find. So stay tuned. This is what I can see. These are really cute. They were swing shoes. I thought they were Adidas, but they're not. And then it's coming around. So, yeah, these are the pictures that I got last night. And they're like 29 .99. But it's like a little texture one i was trying to see what else they had this picture been here for so long like literally so long don't nobody worry about it and then they got i don't know why they who's gonna buy that not a soul this one's so cute but it's natural like that that i have and i do not want to do blue because everybody does blue This is cute. Well, Joey would love that too. That's real cute. That's cute too. I was looking for like a laundry sign because I don't have one of those. And we have the rubber towels. That's cute. But yeah, I was just looking for. Um, oh my god. I might be getting that. I might 
just be getting that. Y'all see that? I might get that. Um, yeah, let's run over here and see what that look like. Oh, this is cute too, y'all. If you have like a green in your room, that's cute. And I do have a green, but not this beige looking color. Oh, this is cute too. This little one, two, three little combination. It would be cute if you don't do it. But I'm not doing blue. And this is. Cute too. I look, it's already right here, so I can see if I can. Probably put this in my room. And then this one is like the whole thing. Um, do they have a lot of them? Yeah, they have like three of them, looks like. Let's see what the last one is. Yeah, the last one got blue in it, as you can see. But I'm gonna get this one. It's a hundred. Let's see. It's $100. And we're off to Home Goods, you guys. Let's gonna see what they have. And then I only spent an hour in another store. Clutch. Oh, this is so pretty. Do this, do this. Also oh, squishy. That's cute. Oh, I'm gonna start to go to back this one. These are the cute. I don't know what that is. Oh, look at the little hocus pocus shoes. Why oh, that's so cool? That's pretty obsessed. I hate coming this way. I don't know why I do that every time. This is cute. Oh, one, twos. Oh, this is really cute. What is it? Oh, that's all pumpkin. Oh, that's really cute. How much is it? I bet you it's $30. So I thought it was $30. Hobby Lobby like would never. Oh, look, they got like little bamboo sticks. That's just really cute. Oh, these are so stinking cute for drinks. Those are cute. Look at the wine glasses. Ooh, they got the bigger one too. That's cute. Seven dollars. That's really cute. It's different. Then they got like these for the alcoholics. My husband has one like this. Well, oh, it's like this. That's cute. That's a cute show. This would be cute if it was a um thingamajig, a candy jar. This one that lights up, which is still stinking cute. I had one that light up like that before. It was like a goldish color. This one's cute too. Then they have like the little bases. We got the witches at. 
actually yeah, the only one I see from my living room would be this one. But I kind of need one that's this color. This one is cute. So I need something like this. Which I feel like I should have bought that thing inside. Because I could put this in the kitchen on the counter. Or like this one would be cute too. And that's 15 but these are like nine. I don't know what brand this is, but these are like ten dollars. Which I think I'm gonna get this one. But I was thinking about that one, but it's that they, they don't match. There's like a brown. It's like a brown. And I'm gonna get these. Which one I said I want to put on the counter? Let's see, look, that was seven. Don't know what I'm gonna put in there yet. Yeah, I like some. Mini pump is grassy. I like this one. It's tan. That's really cute. Like these can go. Or, the, um, or should I get like a small one and a big one? You know what? Let me see. So I'm gonna show y'all what I'm what I'm going for. So if I put this one and then I put like a, I think I'm gonna get this small one though, cause this one is cuter put that one and like this one behind it like this like on the thing yeah that's cute because that big one is too big so we're gonna get this one and we're gonna get this one oh my god these plates are fucking gorgeous and look how much they are a piece these are cute as fuck and they have like the little gold, the silver bowls to go with it. This is cute too. This one's 10. Which is not bad. Uh, I might actually get this. Don't know what I'm going to put in it yet, but hey, whatever. This is cute too. If you want like a, a vase to be on display on top of it, that'll be real cute. Y'all look, I found this one. And it's 130. So fucking pretty. Guys, so it is two days later. Y'all got a whole, whole band-aid on my finger. So we are starting um to I guess remodel, touch up our house or whatever, make some changes. A lot of changes actually. That I actually want to do so um, But I'm going to end this video So I'm going to show you the haul of everything that I got Not everything because I think I put like A lot of it up And a lot of the actual decor decor stuff I'm not going to show y'all that's going to be in the remodeling vlog So y'all got to stay tuned to that And you also got to follow me on TikTok Because I'm going to give like little previews or whatever Of that So I went to T No I, didn't. I actually forgot about TJ Maxx to be honest I went to Home Goods twice Ross four times, Walmart twice. I did not go to Target, which I'm mad at myself for that because I seen on TikTok that the girlies are going to Target and they're getting a lot of cute stuff. So I might go there Thursday on my lunch break, or I might go no, because I can't do that. I might go there Thursday. We gonna see. Don't hold me to it, but we gonna see. So basically, I am redoing the pantry. If you've been following me for a while, my pantry has been the same for almost two years now. And given that we're about to switch up the color of our house, like the inside, like the accents, like of the, as y'all see, like the fireplace and like the top molding, crown molding, as they would say, and the bottom baseboards and stuff, the doors, all that stuff. Is, the walls are also getting painted too, but that is going to be like the biggest change of everything. I want the pantry to match. Like, it's only right that the pantry match, right? Right. So, I bought... Um, I started buying some more clear containers, but this time I bought like some different, I want different, it's like a different style or accent. So y'all gonna see what color I'm going with. I'm gonna reveal that in the next video, but y'all probably gonna get a hint of it in this video too. So I bought this. My husband loves tea when he's on his tea hiatus. Like I buy him all kinds of tea for him to try. Um, and I'm going to show y'all what the tea cabinet looks like. I think I showed y'all before and I was been supposed to start. But I found one of the ones that I actually wanted. And like every time I go, I'm just going to get an extra one. Because 
he has a lot of tea. This one has, and y'all know Air D showed us how to organize tea, baby. So I had to go give me one. So this is only $4.99 at the Ross. If you don't believe me, hopefully it focus. If you don't, y'all y'all believe me. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. He has two, four, I think it eight slots. Two, four, six, eight. It has eight slots and they are pretty big. As y'all can see, it's pretty big. So some of his tea is gonna go into there. Um, I got some, um, this is like off topic or whatever, but I got some candy, um, because I actually want to make a treat jar for my kids. Um, I was going to put it at the front entryway, but I'm going to show y'all the front entryway as of now. I'm going for a more modern, not so modern, but like homey style. So I don't want like the entryway table anymore. So I'm getting rid of that. So I have to find somewhere to put my kids candy jar. Um, Oh, I also went to Sam's, y'all. So, we're going to switch around. This is like the good angle of everything. And y'all, as y'all can see, this is my tripod right now. And I got to return this too. Let me tell y'all about this. I'm going to tell y'all about this. I did a TikTok unboxing um, with that. And it is so trash. Let me tell you. Just beyond trash. It's hard work. And I don't like doing hard work. So, I need the, I need the carpet thingy with the with the handle like they can't do it for me so um i went to home goods like i told y'all i'm trying to where is everything girl everything is over there on the other camera but y'all i finally found this um they have this at target so this matches like the gold accents that i have i'm gonna show y'all that as well but um this is basically like a little paper towel holder that i wanted to get i don't know if I'm going to keep it or not, I haven't made up my mind yet because I don't know how it looks yet. But I think the round part, um, my daughter was pointing out to me, might be too big for the spot that I actually want to put it in. So we got that, and it was only $7.99 at, at uh, Home Goods. Um, I got some more of these, which I put y'all on. If y'all ever see these in Ross, do not buy them. Listen to me. Do not buy them from Ross or at Homes. Go to Walmart. Ross and at Homes always upsell these. Like, they always, like, I don't know, almost double charge for them, to be honest. But these are, like, $5 at Wiley World. Like, you go to Walmart, they're $5. You go to Ross. No, you go to at Homes, Ross, and all of other places, they're $9. Like, they're charging literally almost half, double the price. So I got these, as y'all know, these are in my laundry room. And I'm going to show y'all these as well because um, I have to restock the laundry. So I got two of these to actually go underneath the kitchen cabinet. So that is that. I got two of these from Walmart. Um, I bought sponges just until I find the color sponges that I want on Amazon. This is like a little BS haul. I got another one of these because I always, you always need these. They get nasty so fast. Um, I bought a whole bunch of cleaning stuff to refill underneath. I bought a bunch of cleaning stuff to refill underneath the cabinet in the kitchen. Y'all are going to see me do that. I always put y'all on so when y'all go to Sam's, instead of going to Walmart and paying $2.89 or $2.79, I think, a can, you go to Sam's and pay $2 a can. It's $8.00. For this, I'm saving you almost a dollar per per one. And if you have kids like me, do not let your kids spread. You spread because London always empties half the can every time she washes the table. Literally every time. I also got some of this snuggle stuff, which was on sale at Sam's for like nine bucks. They had these. Let me put y'all on. These, I believe, downy. DM me. These are so, these smell so good. I don't know if these are like, uh, you know how Downey has those um, different scents for like different um, seasons, but these are on sale for $10. Y'all know these run like a good $15, $18 each. And it's been a long time since I bought some of these. Let me tell you, because the cost of everything is going up and these ones are really essential, but they, they're going to be essential they, if they continue to be on sale. So I'm gonna keep looking for sales for those. Um, I got some Tide Pods because they were $22 a box as well. If you did like Scan and Go or whatever at Sam's. So I got these and 
you get 156. So bulk shopping is smart. Don't let don't never let nobody tell you different. Y'all know we always buy Sam's paper towels, so I got some to go underneath the cabinet, some are already in the pantry. I mean in the lunch room, and then I also got this, I believe it was like five dollars, and I never buy this, but it was on sale, so I got it. And this is for the dishwasher, which our dishwasher has been tripping. So frigid, I think it's Frigidaire. DM me so we can talk. We need to talk. And then I also got these to go with it. Didn't even know this was the same brand, so I just looked at it. And I think these are like $13 for a pack of, for a box of 100. And we had to do dishes, so I had to open one with, I didn't want to. Moving around along. Oh, I also got this, and we had to open this as well from Sam's. And I think it was on sale for $15, and you get 16 of these, which is a steal because I think a box of two costs $4. So we got that. Um, I bought some of these because I've been seeing these on TikTok and like when you cook like cute stuff and you want to plate it like really really cute these are the go the go to for that so i'm gonna try these um target has them in like a whole not a whole bunch of colors but they have like the bougie looking colors if that makes sense so like it looked like it won't fade but these are not going in the dishwasher we're not putting our bowls and plates and stuff in the dishwasher anymore because it ruins it and i'm gonna show y'all why I also got this from Walmart, and I'm going to go back and get another one because we have a lot of kids, and yeah, we just need a whole bunch. And they didn't have a 16 count that came with the mugs in this color at the Walmart that I went to, so I was only able to snag the 12 count, and which is all black, which is really cute. So I got that. Maybe you do not have to buy expensive plates because my kids do not eat off of plates like this anyways, unless like we don't have any... um. Plastic plates, which I got some of that from Sam's too because it was on sale. Next, I'm going to show you guys like all of the decor. Not the decor, but I'm going to show you like little bits and pieces of it. I also bought blinds for the dining room area because I'm taking the curtains down. I just want blinds to be right there. Which I think is going to be so stinky cute. yeah okay so also for my kitchen i got this and they said this is supposed to be able to like bend and stuff like that which it does as you can see like it bends for like your uh see it has like your sponges and stuff on here and i got this from at homes and it was like 3.99 you can also put it like around your sink i just needed something temporary to figure out what i really want and i thought three dollars wasn't bad um because it's about to be Halloween, it's about to be fall, I wanted to bring in like the rustic color in my living room. Haven't decided, but I kept this because I know if I took this back, I wasn't going to find it no more. And um, the next time my husband is off, it's like a couple weeks from now. So I don't know if we're going to make it to New Orleans, like the middle of New Orleans to go to at-homes to the real good ones. It's not in the middle of New Orleans, but it's kind of far. But this from Ross and it was $8.99 and the sticker's home in my purse. I don't know why the sticker, how the sticker got in my purse child. I have the slightest clue and I don't know why this girl did this but it's like one of my bowls are stuck. Oh it's not stuck. Maybe she did that for security purposes. I bought this bowl to go in my room but I actually think it's gonna go better in my living room now that I'm looking at it. And it didn't have a price tag on it, so the girl actually put a price tag and it's $29.99, which I believe these things are supposed to be like $34 because look at it. And I'm gonna put like some cute little balls in there. I wanted it to go in my room so that I could put the grass balls in there, like, or do like the, uh, put the paper on it and buy the mosh uh, sheet and put it over there so it can be like really cute. Haven't decided on it yet, but I know I am going to keep it. I'm not taking it back. Um, and for $12.99, absolutely not. Because I know this bowl is supposed to be a good $30. Like, real life. And y'all going to see why I got this. to see what it goes with. Um, I finally found me, like, a fruit, a fruit stand that I actually like. And I don't... I might put this in a pantry and I, or I might just let it stay 
<coughs> on the counter, depending on if I have space or if I don't, it's definitely going in the pantry. So, like, the bananas and stuff can go at the top, and or like the lemons can go at the top, the bananas can go at the bottom. I always wanted a fruit stand, but I never found one that was really cute. And you can also spray well, I wouldn't spray paint it because you're putting food on it, but yeah, I got that. As y'all can see, y'all probably already guessed the color, so that's we got that going for us. And then underneath my sink, the cabinet, as y'all can see, next to the dishwasher, it's not really big, but it's big enough. And I have um, gray, like little trays under there, and I hate them, they're disgusting, so they're going in the trash. But I bought some more, y'all know I love the vinyl brand, the Bino brand, or whatever it is. Um, but I have these, and I got these from Home Goods, and they were $16.99 for two. And as y'all can see, I got two of the big ones. So like all of my um, cleaning supplies and back stock of laundry stuff is gonna go under there. So I bought that to go under the sink. Um, and I'm seeing today they have a, um, a mat on Amazon that catches like the water and you can just take it out and it doesn't ruin the bottom of your cabinets. So I think I'm gonna actually get that. Um, yeah, I think I'm gonna actually get that. So. Moving right along, I gotta go get the rest of the stuff for y'all to see, so, hold on. Okay, y'all, so before my camera die, I need to hurry up. Or if it die, I'm just show y'all this stuff another day. Um, but, I bought this. It's so beautiful, but I don't know if it's gonna match the first bowl that I saw. But, a lady told me that it's actually a cake tray, so I got that going for me. But it was only $20, so I got that. And let me show y'all what it goes with. So yesterday I went back like a second day and they had these out. So these are plates that are gonna go at the bar. See it matches with my bar stools and I'm gonna make it like really cute. I'm gonna buy some um, decorative napkins or whatever to go with it. And then I also got this, which um, like I said, I probably put like some grass balls. I haven't decided what kind that's gonna go right here. Either that or I'm gonna make like uh like candles, put candles here that might fit, might not fit, don't know yet. Um, so I got that. And then I also got this, and she actually told me it was a serving tray. And this was $12.99 from at homes. I mean home goods. I keep saying at homes because I wanna go there, child. But this is like a serving tray, but I'm gonna use this for my coffee table. And as you can see, you can kind of just put your candle i was thinking like getting like the little cubic chain that's black heavy going on there and probably put this on top of my time four book which i think would be really cute so i got that as well and that is pretty much all that i'm gonna show y'all which i already showed y'all a lot but yeah that's pretty much all that i'm gonna show for right now i have been cleaning up since about nine o'clock ten o'clock this morning and i have not gotten out of my room as y'all can see i'm currently in my bathroom my baby tub is like air drying in because I cleaned it. Um, so I decided to like try to deep clean because we are starting to remodel. Uh, should I say remodel? Yeah, so we are starting to remodel in process of our home. Not technically remodeling, but kind of sprucing it up because we have kids. The kids have destroyed our home for the most part, in my opinion. Um, so, um, we have to redo floors, pull up carpet. Our carpet looks horrible. Like, it looked like we just live in the, the hood and we just been living in this house for seven years. Like, our carpet is horrible from foot traction because I didn't hold up my end of the bargain of making everybody take off their shoes whenever they enter the house. So, like, wherever there's carpet, it's just, like, high traffic. Um, we've tried to shampoo the carpet. We've rented shampoo shampoos we've bought shampoos we tried everything um underneath the sun but it seems like you know it did not work of course it didn't work not work i'm not gonna say it seemed like it didn't but it did not work um so i just came to the conclusion i just told my husband like you know just just pull up the carpet we have four rooms um that actually has carpet well we have three now we have three that still has carpet my son we pulled up his carpet and did floors and me and my husband did like a project together which we really enjoyed like that's how we spend time like we do just like little stuff like that together um and we did it backwards so my son decided he wanted to like pull the whole flooring up so now we have to redo everything so we're just gonna start from scratch and i also 
I found some flooring that I liked. Um, so me and my husband are just basically trying to come to the conclusion of if we're going to do all the floors in the kids room in that style or if we're going to the floors that I chose for my room if we're going to do it throughout the house which I'm thinking that would be better because when we sell our house in a couple years a year or two um that's why we're actually doing this is because we're in the process of thinking about just starting on another project um because our house is too small our family has grown like I have we have a ton of kids so and plus I need office space he needs his gaming space the kids need bigger rooms more bathrooms we just need a lot so I decided that I'm just gonna start being consistent with content that way the content can help me pay for my house you get where I'm going with this so I am currently in my bathroom which I cleaned up my bathroom I'm gonna show y'all and I'm working on my room and I'm gonna show y'all like the stuff that we're about to start working on I think we're gonna start on my room first and work our way that way and then over to the other kids room so the way our rooms will work like on one side we have rooms and the other side of the house we have rooms as well and then we also have to paint the kitchen and i'm gonna show y'all that i'm gonna show y'all exactly why um i'm late getting started on this video and i'm trying not to talk as much because a lot of people like when i talk in my intros and a lot of people like when i just get to the point so i'm gonna just get to the point so let me show y'all okay so this is my bathroom let me turn my lights on so y'all can see so my bathroom has like the little toilet here um i have my little picture here y'all yeah. oh. I'm so I have my little picture here and I want to redecorate like because I want to put this picture back here because I feel like this picture is like way too small and I had this picture linked up like right here where this is and I kind of redid the whole decoration of my bathroom so I'm going to put me and my husband took our first bathroom picture together like at a hotel and it came out really really cute so I'm going to get that printed out and I'm going to put it in here because it just brings back memories of when we first met and the stuff that we used to do so I just thought that was real cute but I have redid the decoration in my bathroom so this is how it looks yeah this is future future mama bought him these um she thought I had a diaper genie but nobody bought it off my registry and I wasn't buying a diaper genie unless somebody bought it for me to be honest because I use it but not all the way through so um my husband probably is gonna go exchange this for me um at the wally but y'all i bought this candle i needed to focus so y'all can see y'all i bought this candle from dollar general and it smells just like mahogany teak wood and i think this was like five or seven dollars so put y'all up on game go get y'all one from dollar general but okay and i also need my husband to um put this up because um i'm gonna buy me a versace robe and i'm gonna buy him a new versace robe um so i want it to hang like where our shower goes which is like right here in between the shower and the tub because sometimes i take a bath and he always takes you know between baths and showers so i want our robes to like hang here because i feel like that'll be cute i was gonna put it like on both sides but i don't know i just feel like what y'all y'all let me know what y'all think or i have like a little space like right here where i could put them like right next to the shower so i haven't really decided and i kind of didn't want to do anything until we paint um and i'm gonna show y'all why i said we need to paint so our baseboards are just completely trash um and then like we have like soap scum all over the walls i started this project with the tape did not finish it um and then it's just dirty so the paint job that the um the company that built our house did they did a matte paint and we have kids and we specifically asked for something with a little shine and a little gloss and they did not do it so me and my husband now have to come out of pocket and pretty much paint our whole entire house which is going to cost us it's not going to cost us much as much because he decided he wanted to paint it himself but like stuff like the doors get truly dirty fast the baseboards get dirty fast because they're white um but yeah, so let me show y'all my room. And here's free. Be greedy. With Junior socks on. And I'm not gonna show my baby because y'all not about to talk about her. You can have some. Where's your cup? Go find your cup and come back. Okay. So show y'all my room or whatever. And I'm gonna show y'all what I exactly what I'm talking about. So ignore the sofa. I got this is all laundry that I have to clean up. My ring light. 
broke the stand. It didn't break, but I'm gonna show y'all exactly why I, I use this stand. I'm just rigging up all kinds of stuff. I'm in the my middle of cleaning up, so y'all don't talk about this. The carpet is horrible, like I told y'all. It's just a lot of feet traction, traction that happens in my room. Um, y'all also cleaned off my dresser. I didn't wipe the bottom part, so if it looks dusty on camera, just ignore it. Y'all, I found these boots for Junior at Ross. These UGG boots for the winter time. <coughs> Excuse me. So, I found these for Junior, y'all, and they were only $20 at Ross. I'm going to get tired and sick and tired of telling y'all go to Ross to find y'all baby some stuff. But, yeah, I got this for Junior. And I need to put this up because I never even used this. Um, my baby car seat is in my room, but the uh, insurance company sent me this, and I need to start wearing it, which it says pregnancy, so y'all comment down below if I can use this after the fact, because I don't really know, and if y'all hear future in the background, he just rude too, so, he just hate me to talk, like, in his presence, y'all, like, he likes stuff to be completely quiet, and, like, once you start talking, he just start just going off, so, yeah, I have this Tom Ford book that's linked into my Amazon storefront, I've been had this, and, um, yeah, I didn't utilize it, so now I have it here. Ignore my necklace. I was looking for a necklace stand to go in my bathroom. But yeah, so like my dress, I cleaned it off. I took this out of the bathroom, and I put this stuff in. And I want to put um, some more pictures of me and my hubby in here because we like looking at ourselves. And then I got these from At Homes like a couple years ago. So I still have these. We put like our controllers. This is the other one that I need to find out where the little kickstand went. But we put like our remotes and controllers and games and stuff in here for my husband so he can keep up with his stuff. And at the bottom is just like uh, batteries and all the other stuff. And our TV hangs on the wall. Um, my room is forest green, gold, and black. And as y'all can see, my walls are black. But it's too dark in here. And I like to do content or I want to start doing more content. But before I actually decide to actually repaint my walls this week or uh, tomorrow, I'm actually going to go get some blinds to put in our windows. Because as y'all can see, we don't have any. It's just curtains. That way, I can just open the curtains and open the blinds if I want to do content. Um, then I got this mirror that I'm also keeping. And then I have my... We both have these dressers on each side and then i have this and we put like our headphones and charges and stuff at the end of well at the beginning of the day inside the head and then we use this light for future at nighttime that way we don't have to cut on the light so the way this works is my husband ordered this from amazon so i'm gonna link it in my amazon storefront if y'all have kids this is a great light did i plug it up i feel like i did maybe i did yeah so this is a great light if you have kids that scared of the dark or um like for fake them i don't let them watch tv at night when it's school nights so we use lights like this to be able to um so they can have like a night light and i'm not gonna shine this in y'all face because i hate for it to shine in my face so it has a remote too i forgot why i put the remote no in a second but i'm also keeping my pictures so my maternity pictures that i took with free y'all look at future i'm not gonna show my baby face but y'all look he just he hates for like people to be in his presence and talk but y'all so i redid my bed i put i finally put my pillows on my bed that i got from um wait she has a tag on her all of her pillows i believe so if y'all need somewhere to get some decorative pillows from definitely check out her website and tell her that i sent y'all but i bought all my pillows from her um these i had for like two years and i just now put inserts in them so this one is like a forest green that matches with the curtains and then i have this golden black one and then i have these gold ones that i took off of the sofa because i'm redoing my sofa with like an orange and gray because my sofa is like a gray a velvet gray and then i got all of these pillows from ross as well this comforter came from ross which i thought it was so cute with like the little gold detailing um but yeah, so I'm keeping my our pictures. So like this ambiance, I'm gonna keep that. I need to wipe this down. I did my husband's side of the room yet. I have not, as y'all see, I have not did my side of the room. So all of my stuff is literally everywhere. You got future bass in it that needs to be cleaned out. And I need to wipe down like my pictures and stuff like that. But I'm tomorrow, once we decide we're gonna paint, I'm gonna start probably taking this tape off that I did in a vlog. If y'all haven't seen it, it's on my channel somewhere. But I kind of taped it off with uh, gold screens of tape, which is cute. 
y'all the grass wall has been sitting for like two years and we have yet to get our name but i'm gonna look on amazon for somebody because i think i'm gonna keep the grass wall just because i try to sell it and nobody wants to buy it given that i paid like lots of money for this grass wall i didn't want to just give it away so i'm gonna actually keep the grass wall so yeah that is how my room is looking i have a ton of laundry to fold and i'm gonna work on that so um y'all gotta see this wrong future and i'm gonna be right back I gotta click free out because free is so loud and ghetto it's ridiculous but y'all so basically what i'm about to do in this vlog it's sad that i'm whispering at my own house like i'm the child and he's the adult like crazy crazy um so yeah basically we're about to deep clean um and i'm gonna finish with my room um what i wanted to do which let me show y'all because i don't think i never showed y'all like how my bathroom like how i organized it before but i never did it on camera so basically my bathroom is organized just like my pantry but i've kind of been just throwing sh stuff in here um this is junior's cologne y'all i keep my his daddy gave i bought this for his dad but i started using it on him and my husband's like um yeah i don't want to use the same thing he using so he can have it so that's junior's and i gotta get his cologne game up but basically like you know, I just need to take this out organizing and also all of this stuff like this. We don't use this. I need to throw this away. This is like the worst edge control ever made. Like, it's just nasty. It leaves white residue. Like, it's just disgusting. And we don't use beeswax. I don't know why my husband always buy these people's products whenever he goes to the store. And as y'all can see, it is completely full to the brim. I don't like this. Like, stop buying this stuff ish and i just hate beeswax beeswax is not made for people here and then i got all this stuff like baby stuff listerine this is stuff i clean my ring with um you use tea tree oil. i had this for like you know whenever you get like those little bump not little bumps but you know how you first get a piercing and sometimes you might get a bump or you might need this around your edges if you have dandruff really bad tea tree oil is the best way to go make sure y'all get that this i don't even use this like that's what I'm saying. Like, most of this stuff in here, I don't use. But, like, y'all, I just like these little round things. I seen another one yesterday, and I should have got it. It was a smaller one, and it could have fit right here. I'm going to go to Ross tomorrow, and I'm going to bring out with me to see. Because if they got it, then I'm going to get it. Because this not even supposed to go up here. This is supposed to be up here. And I need to go through all this, too, because I don't even think my husband take one of these anymore. He has, like, another vitamin. And then, like, this is just stuff that we don't use. So, this all needs to be organized. The kids take their bath toys and throw them in this bag. And to be honest, the bag stinks. So, I think it may be mildewed. I don't know. It just needs to be thrown away. So, I'm going to go through those toys and take our stuff. Keep, like, one or two toys for them and throw it away. But, I also have, like, under my cabinets are horrible. And all of the girls have... A hair bucket with all that with their names on it and fates is the worst because fate had the most bows and beads and stuff because she's like the the smallest one that lets me still do stuff to her hair and stuff like this like this is disgusting like so i'm about to start cleaning this in here first and then i'm gonna get to my room as y'all can see i have my makeup stuff still crayon case it's like pretty much all of the makeup that i ever bought um like, I literally have pretty much all of her stuff. And I don't even use it no more. Like, I don't even wear makeup anymore. So, I need to clean that out. And then, I have, like, all of the kids' hair stuff. Um, hair that I bought that Nala did not want in her hair. So, I have all of this stuff to actually clean up. So, I'm going to do that on camera, too. And then, I have to go through this container of, like, all of my accessories. Like, underwear, hats and sweatpants and stuff and then i'm gonna put future stuff after i go through his stuff because he can't fit newborn or zero to three month stuff anymore so i'm gonna actually go through that and then put it in here and then put it back in my closet so yeah that let me set y'all up because i had a to-do list on my phone because i watched the vlog early this morning and i feel like i vlog better like i get to the point 
when I put a to-do list in my phone and like go point for point. But this is going to be a two-day vlog because I know for sure I'm not going to be able to be finished cleaning up in this one vlog. Plus, you know, redo everything. And I want to write down my grocery list for this weekend. So, this weekend I'm going grocery shopping. So, I'm going to be back doing my Sam's hauls and stuff like that. Um, grocery shopping and I want to redo my pantry. So, I saw some cool things at um, Target that I wanted. But I want to sell what I have because I really paid a lot of money for the organization stuff. And when I take it out the pantry, I literally have no place for it to go. So, without further ado, let's get right into the deep cleaning.